we are confronted with big challenges. The world population increases, the age of the population increases, the resources are limited, and somehow we have to anticipate where this development goes and we have to do research now to uh, find solutions for all these problems. The Science Tunnel is an exhibition of the Max Planck Society. The Max Planck Society is one of the most distinguished um, organizations for basic research in the world. And the Science Tunnel that was firstly installed in the year 2000 has now its third generation and is touring around the world. There are many things here that we've never seen and it's an opportunity to see this for the only time in life. Through the Science Tunnel, we are bringing together Siemens and Max Planck Society uh, with both perspectives, a perspective of the business and innovation and a perspective of research. Because science is the base of all innovation. One of the biggest challenges we have also every day is, is how to attract and to foster the sense of interest of the young generations and the newer generations coming into the business, coming into the day-to-day -day life uh, for science. So we bring students here and we want them to be astonished and amazed of what technology is capable of doing. Siemens is able to transform science and research into business and into solutions for our future. This tunnel shows that in fact technology only exists because there were a lot of people thinking of specific components that allow that this equipment really work how we can slide our fingers and change the, the sides because there's a lot of science on optics and physics. Therefore, I think this science tunnel is important to show that aspect and also trying to give new opportunities and new visions to young people. I think the part of the electricity that we have here is the most important no fato de ter as energias sustentáveis, que é uma maneira que vai ter que o mundo começar a fazer essas coisas. Que você pode ver o seu corpo assim como funciona de uma forma mais 3D, que ajuda a entender onde está cada órgão e qual, qual a relação deles, é bem legal. The science tunnel tries to anticipate what's happening in 2030, you know, and tries to uh, um, visualize results in research today, you know, to uh, uh, stimulate people to think about these aspects which we want to know, which we are just uh, starting to understand. Essa visita mudou muito para a